This is my 2003 StarCraft 2406 pop-up trailer that I've got for sale. It's a good little trailer. It's got a bunch of extra options. I'm going to just talk you through a few of them as we go through so you've had a chance to kind of see it before you make the trip over. Outside paint or vinyl, whatever this is, is all starting to peel off here. Other than that, the outside looks pretty good. The other side's a little cleaner than this because it didn't have all this striping on it. Um, this is for the cassette toilet. Storage. This area here, of course, will fold down into a bed. There's your power inverter and the uh, CO alarm, which I replaced last year, so we know it's working. Um, I just set it up this weekend, haven't actually fired anything, but when I put it down, everything worked, the, the furnace and the fridge, so I assume it all works. This is a little three-way fridge, kept it propped open. Um, most of these little units, you get a real stinky fridge, but this one's actually just great. And that little three-way fridge does just fine. Um, this has a great little water pump on it. Water tanks, a little small, 20 gallons, I think. Um, a little small for anything too big, but it works out all right. It's got this little detachable um, gas-powered stove. Runs right off the propane hook to the um, to the unit. So you can either pro pull the propane right up out of here. There's a little connection, so you can cook right here inside. Or that'll hook right to the outside of the camper. Um, storage, there's a furnace here, the water heater, a few extra little cabinets. This is uh, one of the reasons we bought this unit originally. It has a shower and the toilet, um, which makes it really nice. Um, those just kind of fold down under a cupboard when they're not in use, and it's got a little curtain that goes around it for privacy, so that works out pretty well. Um, this is the smaller of the two beds, a little queen bed. Notice there are some problems with some of the uh, some of the canvas, we've got some duct tape in a few spots. Um, this spot is the worst of it. There's canvas, there's uh, there's some little tears in a few spots. Um, never had any problems with leaks. We've had it out in some pretty big storms. Never had any problems with leaks, so not too big of a deal, but there's some, some tape around in a few places. Um, another big reason we bought this unit originally was because this has AC. So as long as you have shore power, You've got air conditioning and a heater right here. And if you don't, then you've always got the, the furnace that runs off of gas down there. This is the bigger of the two beds. Again, you can see a little spot or two where we've got some tape on there. I did run some um, sealer on all the, the fabric a year or two ago, so that should be in pretty good shape. The windows themselves are not in too bad a shape see through them and they've got the tint on them and everything works pretty well. Floor's in good shape, the cabinets seem to be holding together pretty well, everything works well, pulls real nice. This little trailer. So I've got this listed up for sale, if you want to come take a look at it, I'm going to leave it up for the next little bit or so, um, so people can come check it out and then we'll put it down and send it on its way with its new owner.